Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel and for today's video. Sobrang cute na mga try natin na makeup today. I've been very excited to film this. We will be trying out the Focal Your X and Rio collaboration. Sobrang cute guys. Like dito sa foundation, nandito sa cinnamon roll. We have My Melody on the powder. My Melody again for the face palette. And we also have itong si Koromi for our lip products. And si cinnamon roll. Ang cute! Actually, iba dito na try ko na sila. Like the foundation, the blush, the lip products. Para kahit paano ma-share ko na sa inyo yung naging experience ko sa kanya. So yeah, without further hinash, let us start with the video. So syempre, mag-start muna tayo with the base. So again, this is the foundation. This is the Focal Your Lasting Flawless Foundation. I have your three shades. So this is CL01. Definitely this one is a lot, lot, lot lighter for my skin tone. This is YL03. And this is YL04. Actually, natry ko na both si YL03 and YL04 on my skin tone. Parehas naman nag-work sa akin, pero I think mas match for me si YL04. By the way, it has a pump dispenser. So, madali naman siyang i-dispense. And this is how the consistency looks like. It's a little bit runny. Since itong formulation na to, it's more on the skin-like side, which yun yung nabitan ko sa kanya. Let's put muna on the side. I-blend ko muna bago ko sabihin. Yes, the consistency of this one is hindi naman siya super duper repes. Hindi rin siya yung makapal. It's just in the middle. Actually, itong si YL04 lang since I have neutral undertone. So, mag-work naman siya sa akin. But it's a little bit warm for my undertone. Okay, that's one layer. This is without. This is with the foundation. So, yes, natuwa ako sa finish ng foundation na to because this has a skin-like finish. Meron siyang nakukuhang glow. As you can see, na-retain niya yung glow ng face ko. Hindi siya yung flat matte na finish. Manipis siya on the skin. Magaan siya. Yet, kapag hinawakan mo siya, kahit na meron siyang radiant finish, ay hindi siya yung tacky. So, nagsiset siya. And it's something na matitimpla mo if you want yung very natural, sheer coverage. Yung parang almost skin tint levels, pwede siya just for one layer. And if you want to build it up, you can add additional layers. And hindi siya nagkikik kahit mag-build up ka. Like, para sa mga nagahanap ng manipest, skin-like na foundation from Focalure, I think this is it. Kasi yung natry ko before, if you watch yung sa kong video na yun, na ginamit ko yung foundation ng Focalure, it's on the much thicker, moussey side. So, this one, if kayo yung type na gusto nyo, manipis lang, good for everyday. Ayan, naglabas na si Focalure. Ang cute pa ng packaging. For me, this has medium coverage and you can actually build it up into a full. Okay, a closer look. Super love ko talaga how it still catches light kahit na meron siyang medium coverage. And nagsiset siya mag-isa actually. If you have extremely dry skin, this is something na pwede nyo nang hindi iset or just set it very, very lightly. But if you have combination skin or oily skin like me, I still suggest to prep your skin well and iset nyo pa rin ng maigi yung skin nyo. If you do baking, you still bake with it. Since again, it has skin-like finish, kailangan nyo pa rin ng help ng powder in order for it na kumapit talaga sa skin the whole day. Although, nung time na wear test ko to, gamit ko siya the whole day, sobrang init lately, alam niyo yan. For me, I can see na it performs well despite the weather. And nung time na yun, hindi pa ako nag-bake. But still, around mga 6 to 7 hours, kita ko na okay pa rin naman ako sa itsura ng makeup ko, sa itsura ng base ko. But yes, I'm a fan of the finish of this foundation and how lightweight it is. So far, I think ito na yung pinaka-bet ko na foundation na natry ko from Focalure. Very quickly, maglagay lang ako ng concealer. Next are these really cute face palettes. Siguro isa to sa mga most favorite products ko from their collaboration. This is the Focalure X Rio All-in-One Makeup Palette. And bugbog na bugbog na yun sa akin actually. So, I have your four different palettes. So, first we have PC02. Next is I think my most favorite. Halata naman. This is PC03. Next, we have PP01. So, this one has a bronzer shade. And lastly, we have OR02 which also has a bronzer shade. So, from the PP01 palette, maglalagay lang ako ng konting, konting contour. Actually, maganda yung mga undertone ng contour na kasama dito sa face palette na to. Kasi tamang timpla lang siya ng warmth and coolness. And hindi siya patchy kasi creamy siya. At the same time, hindi rin siya yung melty na formulation. Hindi siya yung tipong madaling mag-melt kahit gano'n kainit. Actually, pwede rin to as eyeshadow. This one sa PC02 na shade, ito yung favorite ko pang eyeshadow. Kasi ang ganda ng shade niya sa lids. Diba? Tapos walang ka-effort-effort. Tap-tap ka lang. And for the blush, since this is my favorite palette, I will show you itong si PC03. So, unahin muna natin itong shade na to. This one. So, ang ginagawa ko, dot-dot lang muna. Pwede nyo siyang i-blend naman with your fingers, but since meron akong foundation underneath, ayoko siyang mag-move. So, I'll blend it with a brush. Then, let's get this glowy shade. Like, as you can see, meron siyang parang built-in na highlighter. I'll put it at the high points. 
Diba? Alam mo yung parang wet blush look siya. See that? Diba? Parang hindi mo na kailangan mag-highlighter when you're going to use this shade. And what I like about blushes na mayroong built-in na parang highlighter effect, it lifts up the cheek area. Like, look at this area compared to this. Let's put here. I super love yung mga glowy blushes talaga. Like, ang lakas niyang maka-boost ng skin. Like, yung mukhang ang ganda lang talaga ng skin mo. Plus, what I like about these, kaya ito yung pinakagamit na gamit ko na product from them, is that it is very handy. Like, sobrang liit niya. Maliit pa siya sa kamay ko. Yet, ang dami niyong pwedeng gamit sa kanya in your makeup routine. Like, again, eyeshadow, contour, nose contour, bronzer, blush, highlighter. So, ang dami niyong masiskip na makeup step if you're going to bring this, especially when you travel. And how cute is this next product? This is the Focal Year X Sanrio Blur Matte Powder Foundation. And tingnan nyo naman, napaka-cute ni My Melody. I just wish na built-in itong part na to kasi, ayan, gumaganyan siya. But still, ang cute. Saka naka-emboss si My Melody dun sa powder itself. And I have your three shades. This is YL01, this is CL01, and this is PC01. I think ang pinaka mag-work sa akin is itong si YL01. And again, like the foundation, tines out ko na sila together so I can share with you my thoughts and na-wear test ko na rin siya kahit paano. So, I'll apply on this side while I share with you my experience with this. So first, of course, since it's a powder, nature naman ang powder to mattify your skin and to create that blurring effect. And I can say that this is one of those powders that really help blur the skin texture. Since yun naman din yung tawag sa kanya, it's a blur matte powder foundation. And since this is a foundation, as well. So this is something that you can use on its own as your main base itself or something that you can also use to set your foundation like what I'm doing now. Since it's a powder foundation, so expect nyo na hindi siya setting powder, hindi siya fixing powder or perfecting powder. So it's a little bit thicker in terms of coverage and consistency compared to just a setting powder. That's why I'm very careful kung mapapansin nyo unti-unti ako and tinatap ko talaga yung excess para hindi siya makapal tignan since I'm personally not after the coverage with this powder kasi satisfied na ako dun sa coverage ng foundation. But I find kasi nung tinry ko siya na as in na parami ako nang lagay at first, personally nakakapalan akong tignan sa kanya and it was my bad kasi ang kapal talaga nung nalagay ko. Actually, ang ganda nung combination nilang dalawa nitong foundation. Like, given naman yun, of course, they formulated it to work well together. But yes, in terms of how your skin looks, like, it looks blurred, it looks flawless as you can see now. Tapos, kita pa rin yung glow ng skin underneath. And despite the very, very hot weather, again, like, same sila nung foundation. This actually performs well throughout the day. I tested them out mga average 6 to 7 hours. And looking at my skin after a full day, after 7 hours, okay pa rin ako with how it looks, how it performs. Of course, since I have combination skin, normal naman na mag-oil up ako on my T-zone, but it's nothing too excessive. You can see kung i-rank ko silang dalawa sa mga base products na natry ko in terms of oil control, again, on my combination skin, nasa mid-range sila, I can see on how good it controls oil. But yes, look how plakado my base is. I just really hope they add more shades. Yun lang. Now, let's move on to my another favorite part, which are the lips. So, yung sa dito natry ko na, yung isa hindi pa. So, dun muna tayo sa natry ko na. Tingnan nyo naman kung gano'ng kakit yung package. We have Kuromi and My Melody. These are the Focal Your Care Plus Lip Balm. Actually, this has a very unique and interesting packaging. So, ganito yung applicator niya. And then, kung makikita niyo here, meron siyang sariling lalagyan sa loob. So, it's not messy. So, hindi siya yung parang all the time nakasook dun sa product itself. And tignan niyo naman, gamit na gamit ko tong sa akin. What's more interesting about this is the formulation itself. Like, it's really like a jelly, glossy, plumpy finish. Look how it catches light. Like, literal na glassy lips yung effect niya. This is actually one of my favorite shades, itong si PK01. So, guess watch natin lahat ng shades. So, sobrang dali lang nitong gamitin. Gagawin niya lang, dispense product on your lips. Blend it with your finger. That's it. And this is such a very nice your lips but pinkier shade. This is PK01. And then, kapag ibabalik nyo lang siya, all you have to do is wipe the silicone applicator and that's it. Next, we have PK02. Again, this is PK02. Next, we have BB01. This is my second favorite shade. Again, this is BB01. Lastly, we have BB02. Again, this is BB02. 
what I like about this is that it is really a lip balm in the first place. Like, treatment talaga siya. Yet, pasado yung formulation niya, pasado yung finish niya, yung mga shades. To be something na talaga magagamit mo as your makeup, like your lip product itself. So, heaven sent to sa mga merong extremely dry lips like me. Like, treatment na rin talaga siya at the end of the day. Lastly, are the Focal Your X and Rio Tinted Matte Lip Cream. Alam nyo, kaya ako excited dito kasi ang tagal ko nang tinatry and review si Focal Your and isa sa mga napansin ko sa kanila is that ang galing nilang mag-formulate ng mga lip products. So, I have very high hopes with this product. Ngayon ko pa lang siya matatry. By the way, this is the cute packaging. So, si Cinnamorol ang naka-assign dito sa product na to. It has a thin consistency. Hindi siya yung super moussey and the finish is not overly matte. This is NU01. This is PP01. This is PK02. And this is OR02. So, let's start with NU01. <laughs> ang ganda ng shade. Again, yes, it has a thin consistency. Makikita nyo, like, isang layer pa lang. Cover niya kagad yung unevenness ng lips ko. Like, look how this made my lips look plump. And magaan siya. It's one of those lippies na, lalo na if you've tried Focal Your Lippies already, yung signature na gaan nila sa mga lip products nila, that's what you can feel. Like, halos wala talaga. And once it sets, it looks like this. Like, like very natural matte finish. Yung hindi siya restricting sa lips. Ang ganda nitong shade na to. Again, this is NU01. Very, very minimal. Actually, hindi nyo nga halos makita kung nasan dyan yung transfer. Baka yun din yung parts na hindi pa siya nagsiset. Pero sobrang minimal. Wala. Wala talaga. Okay, very quickly, swatch ko lang lahat ng shades. This is PK02. PK02 is a little more vibrant lang than the shades I usually go for. This is PP01. Actually, napansin ko sa formulation is yung initial application niya, meron siyang konting gloss effect, pero once na fully magset na siya on your lips, it has that parang velvety, creamy, matte finish. Again, this is PP01. That's why I saved this for last, kasi I feel like this is the shade na pinakamabibitan ko, yung pinakabagay dun sa look. Again, this is OR02. Wait lang, ayusin ko lang yung hair ko. Again, these are all the shades and this is how it looks like when it's fully set. This is NU01, this is PP01, this is PK02, and this is OR02. This is my most favorite. And this is our final look using the Focal Your X and Rio collaboration. What do you guys think? Overall, this collection made me so happy actually just by looking at the packaging na happy na ako sa kanila as a Sanrio fan. But I'm very happy to know that it's more than just a cute packaging, a cute collection, or collaboration. Collaboration. The products actually perform well. Again, if you ask me what are my most recommended products, for me personally, ang pinaka I find na gamit na gamit ko and has for me the best quality are the face palette, the cream blushes, and also the lip products. Like, you can never go wrong with focal your lip products. So, itong Care Plus lip balm and also this tinted matte lip cream. So nice, especially the shade in OR02. Ang ganda talaga. So, if you're also a Rio fan like me and you've been eyeing this collection, I hope this helps and let me know kung ano yung napusuan nyo so far sa lahat ng dinay natin today. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Again, lahat naman ng ginamit ko will be listed in the description box below. I hope this helps and let me know if you have any video suggestions. Just comment it down below. And kung di pa kayo subscribe you might want to consider subscribing to my channel and liking this video as well. And I also have my other beauty contents on my TikTok and Instagram. So if bet nyo lang, you can also follow me there. So yun, thank you, thank you so much. Stay safe, sobrang init ngayon and I hope to still see you in my next video. Bye-bye!